So I'm here with Madison with Alarm.com and we are going to take a tour of the Alarm.com smart home. Yeah, come Show on. Us. So yeah. here at the front of the house, obviously we have a couple of different devices, one being the Skybell doorbell camera. Um, so one of the nice things here is that you can see who's coming and going from your home. Um, it has a built-in motion detector, so even if the, no one presses the button, you can get a notification with a video clip of who actually came up to your front door. And then one nice thing about having this integrated in with the rest of your system is that from your doorbell call um, that you might have up, it's integrated in with the rest of your system. So you can unlock your front door and even disarm your security system um, right from that call. So one of the nice things about having it integrated with the rest of your system. So all right, come on in. So once we're inside the home here, there's a couple devices here in our foyer that I'll talk to you about. One of them just being a Z-Wave door lock. Um, so having this really makes it super easy to um, give user codes and see who is coming and going. So um, you can set up user codes for anyone you might have in your family. If you have kids, this is great so that you they can use their own user code and you can see when they're coming home and get a notification around that. Um, you can even set up temporary user codes. So if you have maybe a contractor or someone who's just coming to do work on your house for a week, um, you can create a temporary user code for them so that at the end of the week, um, it will just automatically delete that user code and you don't have to worry about going back in and doing anything um, on the alarm.com site even. So a couple of other things in here. We have um, visual verification in terms of video cameras as well as the alarm.com image sensor, which is a patented product up in the, the corner up here. So this gives you the ability to not only know when motion is detected in your home, but also get an image of who or what set off that motion. Um, so it will actually send you a picture or actually four different images of exactly who set off that motion. Um, so this is a step up from your traditional motion detector. Now you can see exactly who set off that motion. And one of the nice things too about the image sensor is that it's completely wireless. It just runs off of two lithium AA batteries. Um, so you're not having to worry about a power source or anything like that. And it doesn't run off of the internet. So uh, you don't have to worry about having sufficient Wi-Fi or things like that. Um, it just uh, communicates by radio frequency back to the panel. And so we'll also talk a little bit about video with alarm.com. Um, so this is definitely a popular feature nowadays having video and actually being able to see who is coming and going inside your home. Um, so with our video solution specifically, this is our 522 indoor camera. Um, this is a great camera and probably our, one of our most popular ones because it also has two-way audio capabilities. So it's almost like having a doorbell inside your home. So you can actually push to talk and talk to whoever is on the other side of the camera, which is a really nice feature. Um, also with our videos, um, you have the ability to um, view live video at any point. So you can essentially peek in from the cameras and actually see um, what, what might be happening inside your home at any time. And we'll also talk about thermostats while we're here too. So um, alarm.com really works with any Z-Wave protocol thermostat. Um, so it's nice that you have a lot of flexibility in the different thermostats that you can have in your home. Um, but we also have our own alarm.com smart thermostat. Um, this is the alarm.com smart thermostat right here. And one of the great things about this thermostat is that it's very simple to program. So locally, you have the ability to just do the, the simple things you need to do, control the temperature up and down, and then also change the mode. And now as far as setting up schedules and rules and notifications around your thermostat, all of that's done from the alarm.com customer website or app. So it makes it very intuitive and very easy um, to set up all of the things that you need to around the thermostat. Another differentiating feature of the Alarm.com smart thermostat is remote temperature sensors. So these are sensors that you can place in other areas of your home so that you can heat and cool your home to the temperature that's detected in that other area. And we have an example of that back in the bedroom, so we'll just take a look back there. one of our 
are remote temperature sensors that work with the Alarm.com smart thermostat. And it's just a Z-Wave sensor that you can put anywhere else in your home. And some of the nice things that this gives you the ability to do is you might put this in an area where um, maybe in a baby's room where you want to be very cognizant of what the temperature is or maybe your thermostat's located in an area where the sun shines on it or next to a door that's often opening and closing and it's not really getting a good read of what the temperature is inside the home or the business. So you can put this in another area so that it's heating and cooling to that temperature and you might even have multiple remote temperature sensors so that it can heat or cool um, that area to the average of what all of the different sensors are reading. Another thing that we'll talk about um, while here is scene control. So this gives you the ability to create a cascade of automation events just by the pressing of one button from the Alarm.com app. So we have examples of scenes set up here in the bedroom so that just by pressing the sleep button here, I can turn off all the lights in the bedroom. The fan also turns on and with Lutron shade control, which we have here, the shades will also draw. So really giving the customer a wow factor of just all of the automation control that they can have in their home just by pressing one single button. Uh, a couple of features that we have set up in the bedroom uh, have to do with our wellness solution. So this is great if you might have a loved one um, that you really want to just be able to check in on, but they might want to be remaining independent in their home as they age. Um, so just with the security system they already have in their home and adding in just a couple of additional sensors, we can really get a great depiction of the activity that's going on in the home. And then this is also great um, just to be able to gauge behaviors. Are um, they getting enough visits to the kitchen for regular meals and snacks? How many times are they getting up in the middle of the night to use the restroom? Um, so just by using that sensor data, we can really get a great picture of what's going on in the home. So a couple of additional devices we have here. We have this bed sensor, which would normally be placed under the mattress pad, um, but it can detect presence in the bed. So you can see um, how many times they're getting up in the middle of the night. Did they get up at all um, when they're regularly um, getting up? So um, really being able to see activity and then also trigger notifications to a loved one who might want to know about activity. So did they get up in the middle of the night and after half an hour never return back to bed? You know, that's a huge fall risk and something that caregivers or loved ones might want to know about. Similar to that, we also have a stationary emergency button. It looks like the big uh, red easy button, but uh, this is great for placing in other areas of the home um, that you might have fall risks. So maybe in the baseboard of a bathroom or something like that, um, where if someone's not wearing their pendant or or a wearable, um, they can hopefully get to this button and press it and it will notify emergency response as well as loved ones um, that they are uh, at risk. So obviously one of the major components that's becoming very popular nowadays is voice control. So not only do you want to be able to control all the devices in your home from an app um, using alarm.com, but now you can also control these devices using your voice. So we have a, an integration with both the Amazon Echo device and also Google Home. So you have your choice in the platform that you would like to use in controlling your home through voice. So I'll do a, a quick example of uh, voice control through the Amazon Echo device. Alexa, ask alarm.com to run the dinner scene. So once again, scene control, having all of these different uh, devices automate just by you know, the click of a button or just using your voice. So here we have the shades going down, the harsh overhead lights turning off, our chandelier turning on, even our TV turning off because no TV during dinner time. So we'll make our way back into uh, the living room here to talk a little bit more about video. So Alarm.com has several integrations, um, one of them being Apple TV. Um, we also integrate with Amazon Fire TVs as well as the Fire Stick. So this gives you the ability, if you have cameras set up around your home, um, to be able to look in and see what is going on around your property. 
So we have an Alarm.com app. This is uh, the Apple TV we have pulled up here. So you can go into your Apple TV with the Alarm.com app and see all of the different cameras around your home. So this is great maybe if you have a, a young child that you know you want to be able to peek in and see exactly what's going on in their room. Maybe you hear a noise that they've uh, woken up. Um, you can just pull a feed up on your TV without having to go and check on them. So great use cases to be able to um, integrate with Apple TV and um, other uh, TV streaming devices. I'll also demo one of our newer cameras. This is our 622 camera, and uh, it all, almost looks even like a voice control device, like another uh, Amazon Echo. Um, but one of the great things about this camera, it has 180 degree field of view, so you can truly see an entire room with this camera, where you might have had to have coverage with multiple cameras. Now all you need is this one camera. And a unique feature of this one, it actually has a call out button. So if maybe you have a younger kid who might not have a cell phone, or maybe uh, this could be an addition to a, a wellness solution where um, you want to be able to have a, a nurse call or something like that, they can just press this button and it will um, push a notification to a mobile device that you can just answer. And then it will bring up a feed of whatever's in front of the camera and you can have that two-way conversation. So that was the Alarm.com Demo House. Thanks for the tour. That was a lot of fun. Thanks, Jeremy.